to me, um, comics are like the ultimate storytelling medium. Um, I feel like it's the easiest way to communicate something that's in your head to um, the people, you know, your audience. I mean, think about it. Like, if you were to do a movie, you're going to need a lot of people to work on that, usually. Um, I, I suppose that some people can do, like, a single person can make a, a film, but it's not easy. Um, yeah, you know, you're relying on other people and you're sharing your vision, and it's never going to end up being the original thing that you saw. Um, which, you know, to each their own, but I like to um, kind of get my ideas straight to the person with no middleman and then on the opposite end of things like you could be a novelist right but then you don't really have any control over the visuals or over sound or anything like that um and so you're kind of collaborating more with the reader um what i like about comics is it's like my easiest way to control my audience and have them see and feel exactly what I see and feel in my head. To me, it's like the ultimate form of communication. And it is something that can be done by one person. Um, and so that's what I love about it, is just that direct connection to the audience. Also, it's kind of great because since there's not really a ton of money in comics, uh, you have to be in it for the right reasons. Um, and also you don't really have a lot of people telling you what to do. Whereas in art with most fields, you just have people constantly lording over you. And I like being left alone, so um, comics is for me. But yeah, there is something about comics. I like that you can read it at your own speed um, and that you can pause on things, whereas a movie will just keep going, um, whether you want to soak it all in or not. Um, so yeah. That is how I feel about all these things about comics and Frank Quietly. So I'm going to wrap this up. Um, thanks for listening. Bye.